Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Yakuza Zero. We had last left off, we had tried and failed to go against Summers. I have since been grinding, freaking doing this thing over and over again, trying to get 15,000 fans, and it pushed me over, like, by a lot. 15,000 fans actually helped quite a bit. Um, also, some of the girls were a high level, some of them were a level 30. Um, particularly, the old lady that I got ended up being max level, so she was one of the people that helped the most. Um, but we're done with one, so let us see what happens now. As you can see, she's max level, so... We we won. Yes, we won. We won against Club Moon. <laughs> you won. How how could this happen? You did it, Majima-san. Ah. We only won because we played but like a team. Thanks all of thanks all of you. <laughs> yeah. Congratulations, everyone from Club Sunshine. Can really congrats. <sighs> I was really going all out, and I still lost. Wow, I can't believe it. <sighs> Man, we barely scraped by with everyone in our club against you alone, Mana-chan. You're kind of scary. Unacceptable. Simply unacceptable. <coughs> uh, I cannot lose. Huh? This cannot happen! Tsukiyama, son? I, I can't lose, not until I crush the grand. Tsukiyama, why are you so hard for the grand? Fine, as the manager of the grand, I'll take you on myself. I got no idea what the problem with the grand is, but go ahead, take it out all on me. Huh? You're a mind, Majima! Okay. Oh, okay then. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it! Stop it! Okay, why do you get to dodge so much? I don't get to dodge when I'm in the middle of Why does it keep disappearing? I'm not doing anything wrong! Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah. Okay, you stunned me when I'm in the air. You ain't bad with this, Tsukiyama. <coughs> I don't need con your consolation. I've been defeated. I lost. Alright, Tsukiyama, spill it. Why were you obsessed on taking down Soto Body's cabaret club scene? You got something against the Grand, too. Don't you think it's time to come clean? My true objective was... to destroy Cabaret Grand, the place that killed my mother. It killed your mom? I grew up without a father, you see. My mother worked day after day, earning very little money in bars and clubs. She raised me with that money. <sighs> it was by no means a life of luxury, but we were happy. But one day, my mother was fired. She was accused of stealing from the club. Of course, my mother swore on her life that she was innocent. She may have had money problems, but she was far too ethical to stoop so low as stealing. In the end, the club didn't believe a thing she said. Of course, she was blacklisted. No other club would fire a woman accused of theft. <clears throat> Although this job search went nowhere, our meager savings windowed. At her wit's end, she took out her life insurance policy on herself and committed suicide. Okay. That's terrible. <laughs> I found out later that the real thief was a club employee who was in charge of the books. If only the club's management had investigated even a little deeper at the time. Or if he, they'd even considered that my mother might not have been lying, she wouldn't have had to die. And you're telling me that club was... Yeah. Yes, it was, gla it was the Grand. The very place you manage. Of course, this was all before your time. The manager in charge of them was a complete and fool. Still, my hatred for the Grand will never die as long as I live. <sighs> That's why I couldn't lose until I destroyed the Grand. That's why I put the five stars. Or put together the five stars. Mana, I'd like to offer you a drink. <coughs> Excuse me? I can't imagine how sad you were to lose your mother. And the people who ran the club were awful. They should have had their act together. But if you keep living for hate and revenge, the life your mother gave you will just go to waste. From now on, let's live a little. Laugh, let's laugh a little. Your mother would probably cry if she knew you went through life wearing all that pain on your face. <laughs> Places like cabaret, cabarets and cabaret clubs exist so people have a place to be happy and to smile. <clears throat> You're putting way too much depth on these things. <laughs> it's a club. That's all it is. Manna, but, but I get wanting to revenge, wanting revenge for the past. That's only natural, but there's something you haven't noticed. Thanks to your five stars, lots of people lost their jobs, their money or whatever. Their lives are screwed now. You're putting all kinds of people through the exact same hell you went through. <coughs> sure, I knew that going in, but it was all necessary. Huh? See, that's precisely why cabarets and cabaret clubs exist. They're for times like that. Pain, sadness, regret. Everyone's got them, big or small, and they gotta carry that shit around every day. Sometimes it's too heavy to carry around by yourself. Sometimes you just wanna talk to someone to talk to. Sometimes you just want a drink to forget. Ain't it our job to stand by someone like that and help them enjoy a little bit of time where they can forget all that? You're carrying too much by yourself. What you need is Club Sunshine's finest to help you forget whatever it is you want to forget. What do you say, everyone? Of course, certainly. <laughs> That's right. You're right, Majima-san. Tsukiyama-san. Let's all have a drink together. Come on! Majima-san. Mana. Tsukiyama san? Gun! Boy. Hey, Tsukiyama, pull yourself together. <coughs> Don't try to speak. Someone call an ambulance. What the hell are you doing? Tsukiyama san. Now, no, now it's just Tsukiyama. Thank you for everything. Truly, it was the only. It was only in the end that you became useless. <coughs> Katomi. Aren't you on Tsukiyama's side? Aren't you his assistant? Yes, I was his assistant. Until now, I was the grand mastermind behind everything! That's all in the past. If Tsukiyama can't earn any more, then I have no further need of him. I was really using Tsukiyama as a revenue stream. Tommy Chan. Think it over it now, the five stars were a joke. Hino, Izuka, Izuma, Kanehara, none of them had any business sense at all. Useless trash, all of them. I should have gotten rid of them as a lot sooner. Huh? Conniving. Once I get rid of you, there won't be anyone left standing in my way. Listen up, boys. 
Dispose of Florida Majima and everyone else here. Kill them all. Oh, please, wait. What is it now, Sakiyama? Begging for your life is so base. It's not my life we're begging for. The girls here have nothing to do with the five stars atrocities. Leave them out of this, at least. Sakiyama, you've gone soft. I'm begging you. Very well. You've been a use of shield for me until now, so I'll honor your final request. But in exchange, Lord Majima, owner of Club Sunshine. What? Come to the Grand. We'll settle things there. I'll be waiting. You'll need to answer for interfering with my profits. I'll make you pay with your life. Okay. What? Hey! Hey! <coughs> Majima son. <coughs> Sukiyama, you alright? He's been shot. I don't think he's anything alright. Majima-san, I have a favor to ask, but would you grant me one? I have no right to ask, but would you grant me one last favor? What is it? <coughs> Please, help her tell me. She's... I think she's a really good person underneath all this. Even though she shot me and killed all those people beforehand. Tsukiyama. Please, her back, pull her back from the brink. Make her see where she's gone astray, just as you did for me. Uh. You got it, I'll stop her. I'll give her a re lesson she won't forget. <laughs> Majima-san, that's the spirit. <coughs> Tsukiyama, hang in there. Tsukiyama! Well then. <coughs> Tsukiyama is in a coma, in critical condition. <coughs> I see. Well, at least he's still alive. But I can't believe Tsukiyama's assistant, Kotomi, was the mastermind behind pulling the strings behind the scene. scenes. Yeah. Yes, as long as she's still around, Sotenbori's entertainment district will be under a dark cloud. Mm hmm? Majrasan, are you going to the Grand? Ah. Yeah, I can't afford to let her take the, make the Grand her personal hangout. I'd start to lose it to my customers, and I won't stand for that shit. Besides, I made a promise to Tsukiyama. Yes, that's the kind of man you are, Majima-san. Yeah. Majima-san, please do this for me as well. For Club Sunshine and for the future of the cabaret club business. Please defeat that mad woman. Ah. Yeah, of course. Please, please, come back alive. I hear you. Ten billion? Poor oh boy. Blocks have been removed from the breaker style. New items have been opened on the ability screen. Cool. Six platinum hostesses. You recruited mana. Okay, I guess she just joined us. I didn't say whether she could or not, but she's there. Is there a skill that allows me to do more damage? Combo boost. Quick step, secret of the night, calm. Not for that one. What about the slugger? Slugger is not got that much in. Sticks, hold escape. Power boost, yes. An advanced move only usable by those who have mastered the bat. Perform a genuine miracle by hitting back bullets with your bat. Oh god. Okay, sure, it's only 200,000. A million. Light trigger on third heat bar. Katana, dagger. Chaku Tortoise Spirit. Tortoise Spirit? Okay. An advanced move only uses where those who have messed with the bat. The attacks are not deflected by walls when in heat mode. I definitely want that. Because the walls are annoying. Your heat gauge will slowly rise over time when you are wounded, however, only fill up to the second bar. Uh, reduces the amount of damage. Immediately strike back when hit, a slugger has, a t has to defend their pride. An advanced move only used by the mass protects against attacks from any direction. Ah! Increases the power of your red attacks when... Yeah. Using slugger, boost the attack. The amount of heat rises when you attack an enemy. The counter attack shot sounds like defense immediately. Recover health when you perform heat actions. Oh, okay then. I'm going this way around. That's 
where he's gone. Uh, he potentially needs to break this. Way. I have a lot of money, so I'm just going to see if I can fill out a majority of this. Won't drop when wielding Kali sticks. Use use a bat to escape from an enemy's grasp. Press B when held by an enemy. Sure. Miles to do this. An advanced move only used by a master of the bat. Knock away thrown weapons and even hit the enemy if you have the time if you time it right. Okay. Heat gauge will slowly rise over time when you open it. Sure. I don't know if that means I have to be in the red zone or if it just means that I take damage. Successfully guarding against attacks will cause the heat to rise. I don't to I mean, that's better than nothing. Open the camera. Dagger won't drop on wheel the dagger or other one has a blade. When wounded, turn the tables on the enemy by bludgeoning and slashing them into submission. Bat and blade. Uh. Only use where those who master the bat allows you to defend against non-bullet attacks reactively while running. Oh, okay. Body blow. Use a bat to deliver a body blow from a defensive stance in this two-step move. Why, why upon successful LB guard? Okay. So I've fully done the, the batter style now. Check Breaker. Breaker has hardly anything. He gives you rise when you do a free pose. Sure. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's you use Phantom Turn during a rush combo. X, left bumper on our direction, then A. Okay. <laughs> Use the power of regular attacks, yes. More health, sure. And then another one for health. Man, Dancer Style just gives you a bunch of health. Launch yourself into attack with Drunk and Abandoned to stagger the enemy more than usual. If there's another 200, then I'll get it. He gave me these rise seat pose. 500. 200. Boost the damage of attacks formed after a free pose. Sure, why not? There we go. Let's leave. We'll buy some more like, green items and then eat at a restaurant and then we'll go see what they have to say. This might be a bit longer than normal because of what's going on. And if I can finish this in this episode, that means I can finish entirely. So let's see if I can do so. How do they know who I am? It's like I'm a celebrity. How does everyone suddenly know who I am? Oh, <laughs> 
Because you can't, fools. Oi, come on here! I'm too fast. You're Crab, Kamiyaki. Two kinds. Two kinds of crabs will grill to perfection. This is filled. Oh my! Right up my alley. Goodbye. If I go all the way down there, so Tsukiyama's psycho secretary is holed up inside. I need to go bounce her. Head inside. I upgraded as much as I could, so I should be. Where's everyone? No staff, no waiters. Hey, assistant lady, wherever your name is, where are you? I've been waiting for you. I must admit, this place is beautiful. The interior shines and sparkles. The girls shine and sparkle. This place is full of bright, shiny dreams. For those who need to forget reality, I'm sure they can find no paradise greater than this. But for some, re for some, reality is inescapable. A comfort house, a comfortable house, a full plate of food and clothes that express one's personality. Only money buys these things. Money is everything. That's why I'm amassing my wealth. The more money you have, the more happiness you can buy. Huh? Some of those are wearing weird suits. You see, that's why you have to die. You are standing between me and my happiness. You really think someone is going to make you happy? Of course it will. How oblivious can you be? With money, you can do anything. Have anything. Buy it. My bodyguards are professional fighters and martial artists. Even men like this do whatever I want if I pay them enough. You're a kind of sad little woman. What did you call me? I said, if you think you can buy anything for money, you're truly a sad woman. I know I'm not wrong. With you out of my way, all of a sudden bodies cover a cabaret clubs would be mine. It's time for you to make your exit, Koro Majima. Soon to be former manager of the cabaret grand. You think I'm going down that easy? You don't have anything coming. Show him what money can buy, boys. You're looking at a new Majima. I have so many skills unlocked that you won't understand. <laughs>
Like, eh? Crazy face. <laughs> How did you do that? Those are my elite bodyguards. <laughs> muscle got your muscle you gotta pay for ain't worth a damn. Gotta imagine what on earth are you? A man. A man with dreams. Now it's your turn. You're gonna get a real earful for all the shit you've pulled. D don't come near me! A minute all the way here, I'm so close. All of the money funneled into certain bodies, nightlife is going to be mine. Money is all that matters in this world. <laughs> Kotomi, isn't he in a coma? Stop it! Tsukiyama, you're okay? Well, I wouldn't say that. What are you doing here? Why did you come? Did you come to ridicule me? No, tell me I came to help you. Why? I shot you. I used you. <laughs> yes, you did. That really hurt. But you've done so much for me over the years. More than enough to make up for the pain you're causing now. So yes, you may have used me, but that doesn't mean I don't still appreciate you. How? You're not making any sense. Oh, I get it. Money. You're here to help me so you can ask me should share the profit later. How much do you want? That's not it, Katomi. I don't need money. All I want is you. What? Let's start over, Katomi. We'll make amends for what we've done and begin such again from stretch. Together. We can build a new club. It doesn't have to be big. And this time we'll work for our customers, not for the money. Tsukiyama-sama. What do you say? Let's make this a part the last of our sins. Put, please put down that gun. No! Tell me, I cannot return to your side, Tsukiyama Sama. Even now, I still know that money is all that matters to me. If only I had the money, my sister would still be alive. Money is everything. That's never gonna change. If you went into business with someone like me, I'd only get in your way. That's why. <coughs> I told me, Tsukiyama Sama, maybe in the next life I'll learn to believe in something besides money. If I could do that, would you let me be by your side again? Katomi, stop! Goodbye. Stop, Katomi! Out of bullets. Or not. Huh? I'm still alive. Damn, that was close, lady. Majima-san, why? <laughs> I'm just looking out for something more valuable than just money. Something more valuable than money? Katomi... You fool, what the hell were you thinking? No matter how much money I could accumulate in my lifetime, I could never buy you back. Tsukiyama sama. <laughs> ah, sob. <laughs> I completely ruined this moment, didn't I? I'm sorry. <sighs> I get it now, you lost your sister when you were a kid. If we had the money to pay for a surgery, we would still be alive today. Or she would. From that day forward, I lived to make money. I believed it was the only way to achieve security and happiness. But I guess I was wrong about everything. Yeah, more than wrong, just straight up batty. <laughs> Majima, come on. You're right. You tell me, shall we be going? Yes, Tsukiyama sama. We'll turn ourselves in. We, we have many pies to crave for. Crave for? Pay for. Good. Thank you. Instead of just going, oh, I'm just going to be going to do my own clubs now and ignore everything that I've done. Uh, right, go sit things straight. After you've paid your debts to society, I want you two to build the greatest damn club ever, you hear me? Yes, I, I'd rather like to build a place like Cut Up Sunshine. The girls, the customers, the staff, everyone always smiling there, such bright, cheerful smiles. No wonder it's called Sunshine. But tell me, I can't wait to live an honest life under the same sun, just like you. Much was that, do you think I can do it? Uh. Yeah, no doubt. Like I tell these girls, a woman's strongest weapon is a smile, not her tears. You're right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, it's almost go time. Is everyone ready? Where is Majima san? <gasps> I'm so sorry, I overslept. Uh, hey, Yuki chan, are you okay? Do you want me to do your hair for you? Uh, I prefer that my hair don't look like a pompadour with a seagull's nest in it, so no thank you. Wow, I've worked 20 days in a row now. I think I'm starting to get a little tired. Come here, Saki Chan, I'll give you a massage. There we go, that's the spot, right? You're just standing there, woman! Whoa, whoa, hand check, Yuki Chan, let's not go there. Hey, guess what I made out front? A snowman with Gorokun's face on it. What? It wasn't even snowing today, was it? How on earth did you manage that? Oh, Manasan, don't tell me you used ice from the ice machine. Wow, good guess, Yuki Chan. 
Yeah, you know when I was looking at the ice, I suddenly had to search create something. Sorry I'm late, I'm back. <laughs> uh, much more, sir. Thank goodness you're just in time. There was a horde of customers waiting by the door. We're all ready to do this? Hi. Yes, I think so. Let's make today another great one. We'll do our best, Majima-san. Let's go. Okay. All right, gather around, everyone. We're all here, then? All right, today we're going to knock it out of the park with every guest, right? Of course. As usual, then. Yeah, all right, here we go. Just everyone nodding. One, two... Sunshine! You've unlocked the legendary fighting style, Mad Dog of Shimano. That's why I paused me to switch to the Mad Dog of Shimano style. Nice. Walking on sunshine. Alright. Alright, let's see what legend mode does. I shot this guy and I will do this. Blah, blah, blah. I am the evil one. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. I was too busy looking for people. Oh, fuck me. Fuck me. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, so fast! What the fuck? Oh, whoa! Oh god, he's taking the ball out! Oh, <laughs> Holy shit! Okay then! That was intense! Alright, then I guess with that, we are finished with oh. episode zero. Fully, for a change. I'm not going to be doing all the other stuff, like the extra bad, uh, quests, like fighting the guy in the arena or whatever it is for Majima. Because um, that would take too long and they're just minor things, so I don't really care. But uh, yeah, this is the actual end of the extra series for Yakuza 0. So thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this series, even though it was short. It got stuff out of the way that we were doing during the main game. This game has been fun. Um, it's ma definitely made me look forward to the rest of the series. So look forward to whenever I get around to doing Yakuza Kiwami, which should hopefully be with some time. I'm not going to just not do it, but yeah. Still got other things to do, so thank you all for watching. I'll catch you all in the next series that I do. And until then, y'all take care, have a nice day, have a nice week, and I'll catch you then. Bye!